Good evening. I'd like to call the board for Monday, March 5th, 2018 to order uh, and recognize that we do have a quorum this evening of the licensing board. Please rise for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Item number one is approval of the minutes from the regular meeting of February 19th. Motion to approve. Second. Motion has been made and seconded. Any questions, comments, or corrections? Hearing none, all those in favor, please signify by saying aye. 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 And opposed? That motion carries. Item number two is approval of operator's licenses that were in our packet. Motion to approve. Second. Motion has been made and seconded. All those in favor, please signify by saying aye. 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 And opposed? That motion carries. Item number three is a temporary Class B beer wine license for the congregation, uh, for, I believe it's the Congregation of Holy Angels for the fish fry and gifts from the heart being held at Holy Angels Walnut Room and Cedar Rooms, March 16th, 2018 from 4 p.m. through 9 p.m. Motion to approve. Second. Motion has been made and seconded. All those in favor, please signify by saying aye. 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 And opposed? That motion carries. Item number four is an operator's license for Christian Wendorf. Is Christian here tonight? Okay, then we'll uh, uh, entertain a motion to adjourn into closed session pursuant to state statute section 19.85 sub 1 sub F, considering financial, medical, social, or personal histories or disciplinary data of specific persons, preliminary consideration of specific personnel problems, or the investigation of charges against specific persons except where paragraph B applies, which, if discussed in public, would likely would be likely to have a substantial adverse effect upon the reputation of any person referred to in such histories or data, or involved in such problems or investigations. Again, an operator's license for Christian Wendorf. Motion to approve. For closed session? Yep, the correct. Court closed session. Second. Motions are made in session and seconded to adjourn into closed session. All those in favor, please signify by saying aye. 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 And opposed? That motion carries. We'll be back in a few minutes, folks. Thanks for waiting, everybody. I'd like to reconvene uh, back in open session and take up item number five, operator's license for Christian Wendorf. Um, Christian, I'm glad you are turning your life around and that things are improving. However, um, the incidents that did happen are a little bit too close to the... Um, present, so I'm going to make a motion to deny. Motion has been made and seconded. All those in favor, please signify by saying aye. Aye. And opposed? That motion carries. Again, Christian, the Common Council will take up this recommendation in probably half an hour or so uh, yet tonight. Be no further business before the licensing board. I adjourn. Good evening. I call the Board of Public Works for March 5th to order. We have two items on the agenda. Item number one is to approve the minutes of the February 19th, 2018 meeting. Second. second. I have a motion and a second. Any comments or questions? If not, all in favor say aye. Aye. Opposed by the same sign, and that motion carries. Item number two, a long-term stormwater maintenance agreement for Quick Trip 806 South Main Street, with a presentation by City Engineer Max Marishaw. Good evening, Max. Good evening, and thank you. Um, tonight I come to you with another long-term stormwater maintenance agreement. It is our standard procedure to have one of those with uh, property owners that are granted a stormwater management permit. That is the case of Quick Trip redeveloping the property at 806 South Main Street, where the Walgreens used to be a long time ago. And um, so this agreement has been reviewed by the city attorney and we would recommend approving it. It specifies the responsibilities for maintenance of stormwater um, facilities um, that are on the property owner, and it's part of things that we have to do for our MS4 permit for with, with the DNR. Great, thank you, Max. Any comments or questions? If not, I entertain a motion. Motion to approve. Second. I have a motion and a second. Um, do you have anything? Okay. Uh, all in favor say aye. 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 Opposed by the same sign. That motion carries. Being no further business before the Board of Public Works, I adjourn. Thanks, Max. Thank you. Thanks, Rich. At this time, I'd like to call the Finance Committee to order for March 5th, 2018. We have three items on tonight's agenda. 
Item one is approve the minutes from the February 19th, 2018 meeting. Motion to approve, second. A motion and a second, any comments or corrections? All those in favor, please signify by saying aye. 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 And opposed? That motion carries. Item two is a resolution supporting the grant application for a comprehensive bike route system through the Wisconsin Department of Transportation 2018 to 2022 Transportation Alternatives Program TAP award cycle. Uh, I think some comments from Jay. I'll just share that this is the resolution that received modification uh, working with staff worked with Ian to bring it for you for you again this evening for consideration. It's the same um, grant for signage and arrows uh, within the city that we applied for for DOT. So this this is the final piece in the grant application process. It's, it's due by April to the state and then once we find out whether or not we're successful in the grant, then we'd come back to Common Council and have that conversation at that time. Any questions or otherwise that entertain a motion? Motion to approve. Second. second. <coughs> motion and a second. All those in favor, please signify by saying aye. 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 And opposed? That motion carries. Item three, award quote Q18-02, Paradise Drive traffic counts and signal timing. Again, a presentation by city engineer, Max Marshall. Thank you again. Um, so every year we do um, traffic counts and we look at our traffic signals throughout the city. Um, we do a corridor every year. Last year we did Main Street. This year we want to do Paradise Drive and next year will be Washington Street. Um, so we have put out an RFP to ask consultants to provide quotes for their services to do that on the Paradise Drive corridor. Um, we've received um, seven bids um, and we opened them in, on, on January 15th. The low bidder is R.A. Smith. Um, it's a company that has done this type of work for us on Paradise Drive and Washington Street in the past. And we would recommend um, awarding this contract to them for an amount not to exceed $10,650. Thanks, Max. Any questions? Motion approved. Second. A motion and a second. All those in favor, please signify by saying aye. 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 And opposed? That motion carries. Thank Thanks, you. Max. There being no further business before the Finance Committee, I adjourn. Thanks, Adam. I'd like to call the City of West Bend Common Council for Monday, March 5th, 2018 to order and recognize we have 11 items on tonight's agenda. Um, starting with uh, item number one, kind of a unique item. Um, we have the introduction of applicants for filling the vacant office of the District 2 Alder person. We have two applicants, uh, Sonia Hanrahan and Mike Christian. Guys, good evening and thanks for volunteering this far. We certainly uh, um, understand your passion for West Bend because we all have it, but appreciate you guys stepping forward. The process tonight um, it may seem a little bit unorthodox, but it's directed by state statute. Uh, so you're here tonight um, to spend up to three minutes or invest up to three minutes, letting us know a little bit about each of yourselves. The council will ask you any questions that they have. When the second person um, goes, we'll ask a few questions of those folks. And then we'll be looking for a motion and um, we'll do an actual ballot vote as to which of you two is lucky enough to be the district to alderman, alder person going forward. Uh, and then that person will be sworn in right away tonight. So, I don't know if you guys have a coin to flip or if it's ladies first or gentlemen's first, um, feel free to step up to the microphone mic and let us know who you are and a little bit about yourself. Well, good evening, folks, and uh, thank you very much for this opportunity uh, to fill the vacant alderman spot for District 2. My name is Mike Christian. I'm a resident of District 2. I live at 128 North 10th Avenue here in town. Um, over the years, uh, I've been a resident here for almost 20 years. Uh, I moved to West Bend to start a restaurant back in early 2000s, and I've never left. Uh, very much enjoyed my time in West Bend, and I really uh, believe in the positive direction that West Bend has been headed ever since I've been here. Uh, and it's cherished history and, and a long-standing long, long standing, uh, 
uh, reputation as a, as a good city for industry and growth and uh, just uh, great park systems and good business environment. So um, I've uh, worked pretty closely with the Downtown Association in the past, doing some uh, committee work for them. I've worked on different committees and, and various uh, opportunities with the City of West Bend. Uh, currently I'm on the uh, Riverwalk Restoration Project uh, in the downtown area, which is suitably right in the uh, middle of District Number 2. So very, uh, very excited about the opportunities in the future of, of the uh, downtown area and uh, both for the business owners and the residents of that uh, district. So. Uh, again, I really appreciate the consideration tonight. Um, I understand it's just an appointment for a, a brief time, uh, and then we'll have to go right back into the election cycle, which is perfectly fine. But um, <coughs> if there's any questions, I'd be happy to answer them. Thanks, Mike. Any questions, anyone, for, uh, for Mike Christian? You're off the hook. Thanks, Mike. Thank you. Good evening, Sonia. Good evening. My name is Sonia Hanrahan. I have lived in West Bend for about five years, but I'm not exactly new to the area. I grew up uh, coming to West Bend and actually going to Candyman when I was a little girl. Um, my grandparents lived in Kewaskum, so we always made the pilgrimage down here, and I was fascinated by the city. I actually grew up in Stevens Point, so I am a Wisconsinite, despite my phone number. Uh, when my family and I moved back to Wisconsin about five years ago, we stumbled upon West Bend. It wasn't a city that I, you know, in the grand scheme of things, I anticipated living in for the rest of my life, but now that I'm here, I think I've drank the Kool-Aid and I love our community. So as far as my civic involvement, I have led my daughter's Girl Scout troop. I teach faith formation at Holy Angels Parish. I deal a lot with the business owners within uh, downtown West Bend. I sell wine and spirits for a living, so I'm familiar with a lot of the restaurateurs and bar owners. And I think that gives me a very unique perspective in that I'm not only uh, a resident of the, the neighborhood, I also deal a lot with business owners. So my neighbors and friends know who I am as well as other people within the community. So really it all started my passion recently was when the trees were being cut down. And I remember walking with my kids to school and I was like, what is going on with this? And I guess I wasn't really aware because I didn't make myself aware. And as I did more research within our community to see how I could be more involved, I saw that there was a vacant position for District 2 and I said, Eureka, it was like a sign. I, I have to at least throw my hat in the ring and I really think that this is the catalyst to be more involved with it within our community. And I think what Mike is doing, being on boards and showing that he is very passionate about where we live is so important. And I hope I can follow in those kinds of footsteps and really just be a good example within my community about the passion that I have for it. Any questions for me? Anybody? Thank you very much. Thank you. Thanks again to both of you, and um, have no fear that the person that is not selected, we have lots of volunteer opportunities. In fact, between now and the uh, uh, second meeting in April, part of the mayor's job is to fill a bunch of voids and vacancies. So I'll be in touch with one of you guys um, very soon. Any final questions or comments? Otherwise, we'd entertain a motion on, these, um, on the District 2 alder person position. I'll make a motion, I guess um, it does go back to Mike's involvement, um, just to see, uh, to, just to be thrown in is definitely different than making your roots planting and uh, I think that gets him off to a good start. Um, so I'd make a motion for Mike Christian. No second. Motion has been made and seconded, actually we take a a ballot vote. Are there any final questions or comments or other nominations? Are there other, other nominations? 
Okay, now we vote on one nomination. Yep. So we, we, you have to, it cannot be an anonymous vote, so there are ballots in, placed in front of everybody um, with your names on them. So everybody will need to use the ballot and vote, and then Stephanie will tabulate the votes. Mike, congratulations. Um, I believe if you would step up and get sworn in, and Sonia just handed your resume off, you will have someone contacting you within the next couple of days. We've got lots of great areas for qualified and, and energetic people to get involved in West Bend. Thank you very much again. We really appreciate it. I am Michael Christian. I am Michael Christian. Having been appointed to the office, been elected to the office of district two older person of district two older person swear that i will support swear that i will support the constitution of the united states the constitution of the united states and the constitution of the state of wisconsin and the constitution of the state of wisconsin and will faithfully and will faithfully and impartially and impartially discharge the duties discharge the duties of said office of said office to the best of my ability to the best of my ability so help me god so help me god Congratulations. Congratulations, Mike and Sonia. Thank you once again. We appreciate it. Item number four is approval of the minutes from the regular meeting, uh, the Common Council regular meeting of February 19th, 2018. Motion approved. Second. Motion has been made and seconded. Any questions, comments, or corrections? Mike, anything to add? <laughs> no. <laughs> <laughs> All those in favor, please signify by saying aye. 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 And opposed? That motion carries. Under the consent agenda, removing item number six um, are the other four items. Motion approved. Second. Motion has been made and seconded. All those in favor, please signify by saying aye. 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 And opposed? That motion carries. Item number six with Alderman Butchlick abstaining is a temporary Class B beer and wine license for the Congregation of Holy Angels for fish fry and gifts of the heart <laughs> being held at Holy Angels Walnut Room, Walnut and Cedar Rooms, March 16th, 2018 from 4 p.m. through 9 p.m. Motion approved. Second. Motion has been made and seconded. All those in favor, please signify by saying aye. 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 And opposed? That motion carries. Item number 10 is an operator's license for Christian Wendorf. Motion to deny. Second. Motion has been made and seconded. All those in favor, please signify by saying aye. 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 And opposed? That motion carries. And item number 11 is a report by Alderman Chevalier regarding the Park and Rec Commission meeting. Uh, we met um, nearly two weeks ago. It was a quick 15-minute meeting, um, just pretty much uh, going over the normal uh, fee structures for all the programs in this coming year, along with another donation from the Johnson Family Foundation of $5,000, which was really nice to go to the downtown Riverwalk. Awesome. Thanks, Mike. Any questions for Mike? And there being no further business before the Common Council, I adjourn. Are there any announcements tonight? Rich? So as many of you know, on April 3rd, we are putting forth an advisory referendum uh, by the um, Long Range Transportation Committee, which is named even longer than that, <laughs> um, which was Alderman Willicat, uh, myself, and Alderman Jenkins, along with Max Marichal. Um, we did a lot of work on it, and we are um, going forth with those questions um, with regards to um, 
the interest in the um, by the constituents to uh, what they'd like to see done with the roads. Um, on March 14th, next Wednesday at 7 p.m., I will be at the CSC meeting uh, to discuss um, that referendum. Um, so if you have any questions, come on out and talk to us. Uh, if not, otherwise, uh, give me a call, give me an email. I'll definitely uh, answer any questions anybody has. There'll be a couple of other opportunities where I'll be around talking as well. So you'll probably be very sick of me by the end of it, but um, you know, I think the, the group did a really good job and I'm looking forward to see uh, the turnout there. So. It's so next Wednesday, 7 o'clock at the Moose Lodge, right? Next Wednesday, 7 o'clock. Come one, come all, Rich is talking. <laughs> Anybody else? Yes, young man. Why don't you step up to the microphone if you'd like. Sorry, I don't mean to bother you with my trivial matters. I'm just curious. I'm a rather enthusiastic person about bartending, and I was just wondering when I would get a second shot at being able to get my license. There really isn't any hard and fast rule, but it's 12 months from now. Um, certainly reapply and keep your nose clean, and uh, we'll see what happens. Thank you. You bet. Anybody else? Then have a great evening, everyone. Good night.